soft you now. The fair Ophelia. Nymph, in thy orisons be all my sins remembered. Good my lord. How does your honor for this many a day? I humbly thank you. Well, well, well. My lord, I have remembrances of yours that I have longed long to re-deliver. I pray you, now receive them. No. No. I never gave you aught. My honored lord, you know right well you did. Take these again. For to the noble mind, rich gifts wax poor when givers prove unkind. There, my lord. <laughs> Are you honest? My lord. Are you fair? What means your lordship? That if you be honest and fair, your honesty should admit no discourse to your beauty. Could beauty, my lord, have better commerce than with honesty? I truly. For the power of beauty will sooner transform honesty from what it is to a bawd than the force of honesty can translate beauty into his likeness. This was sometime a paradox, but now the time gives it proof. I did love you once. Indeed, my lord, you made me believe so. You should not have believed me. For virtue cannot so inoculate our old stock, but we shall relish of it. I loved you not. I was the more deceived. Get thee to a nunnery. Why wouldst thou be a breeder of sinners? I am myself indifferent, honest, but yet I could accuse me of such things that it were better my mother had not borne me. I'm very proud, revengeful, ambitious, <laughs> with more offenses at my back than I have thoughts to put them in, imagination to give them shape or time to act them in. What should such fellows as I do, crawling between <sighs> heaven and earth? We are Aaron's knaves all. Believe none of us. Go thy ways to a nunnery. <laughs> Where is your father? At home, my lord. Let the doors be shut upon him, that he may play the fool nowhere but in his own house. Farewell! Oh, help him, you sweet heaven! If thou dost marry, I'll give thee this plague for thy dowry. Be thou as chaste as ice, as pure as snow. <laughs> thou shalt not escape calumny. <gasps> to a nunnery, go, farewell. Or if thou wilt needs marry, marry a fool. For wise men are well enough with monsters you make of them. To a nunnery, go, and quickly too, farewell. Powers, we store him. I have heard of your paintings too, well enough. God has given you one face, and you make yourselves another. You jig, <laughs> you amble, <laughs> and you lisp. And you nickname God's creatures, and you make your wantonness, your ignorance, go to! Oh, no more on! It hath made me mad. I say we will have no more marriages. Those that are married already, all but one, shall live. The rest shall keep as they are. Do a nunnery. Go. What a noble mind is here on throne. The courtier soldier's collar's eye. Tongue, sword, the expectancy and rose of the fair state, the glass of 
fashion and the mold of form, the observed of all observers, quite, quite down. And I have ladies most dejected, wretched, that sucked the honey of his music vows. Now see that noble and most sovereign reason like sweet bells jangled. <laughs> Out of tune and harsh, that unmatched form and feature of blown youth blasted with ecstasy. Oh, woe is me. To have seen what I have seen. See what I see.